all right what is up guys it's your boy will back with another video today hope you guys are doing good in this video i'll be talking about the top four shorted stocks i'll be giving you guys some key levels on each one and if these levels hit i will be buying them to see a potential short squeeze and get some nice gains in so make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe if you are new and let's get into it do not forget to get the buy and sell signals we have vip and we have regular available vip is almost full vip comes with a lot of stuff so you get the buy and sell signals you get the stock market options crash course you get live zooms every week you get two discord rooms and you have your own vip structured plan for you to trade so make sure you get that first link in the description and let's go ahead and start the video the first one i'll be talking about is cortex me ticker symbol c r t x ticker symbol c r t x this one is about 42.98 percent shorted the float is about 17 million and the short float is about 7.1 million this one is actually the shortest float well the smallest float so i am expecting the biggest move in this first one so buying pressure would have to be about four dollars and sixty cents knowing know how um notice how the buying level is actually above price so what that means is we'll need pressure it's around 435 right now so we will need pressure to actually go above this 460 level then we'll wait for some pullback doesn't have to be the exact level but in that area is where i'm looking for that pullback to send us to higher prices okay i do have an exit i'll probably exit all the shares at about like six dollars so looking for some nice gains on this one i'm not sure if i will exit half at a certain point i probably will to the six about a 30 percent gain so i might exit half around like five dollars 25 cents for like a 13 10 percent gain Somewhere in there, I might exit half and let the other rest kind of run to six. Since it is a risky stock and it is considered a penny stock right now also. So any stock below $5 is actually considered a penny stock. So make sure you watch out for that. But these are the main two levels I'm looking out for right now on ticker symbol CRTX. Next one is Blink. Ticker symbol BLNK. Ticker symbol BLNK for blink charging this one is about 40.97 percent shorted the float is about 36 million and the short float is about 14.9 million so a little higher than the first one now i did have an old buying level though here that i should have bought if i was watching it because we would have been up probably like 16 percent or so wasn't watching it but buying pressure did come in if we go to buying pressure level buying pressure came in actually twice entry here send you up to the exit Notice how resistance came in. It pulled back down, broke the resistance. Resistance acts as support. That's bullish. Stock did go up the next day. So levels did hit perfectly. Hopefully you guys got in that one. That's why I say don't miss a video. Make sure you smash the like button and subscribe. Now, for blink charging, we're hitting some pressure. Okay. We're already hitting some pressure. So what I want to do is I actually want to let it come up to this resistance level, probably like around 20 I would say about 25 we'll, we'll put it at like 25 25 in that area we'll be expecting some resistance so i actually wanted to come up to that resistance then i want to see some pullback back down to a buying level of about 2460. so it still has to make a little bit of moves before i would like to enter right there okay so where it is now what i want to happen i want some pressure to come up Hit the resistance level we get some selling pressure off that resistance level back down to our buying area and then we enter to go higher and where i'll be looking at to exit those i'll probably be looking to exit the first exit i really want to hold these probably a little bit longer to around 30. so that'll be a nice potential gain that we can get out of blink charging to your symbol blnk about a 22 percent gain I like this one a lot as long as we can get that resistance to do some selling pressure and then come back down to the buying area then that's what i'll kind of want right here so let me draw that out that's what i'll kind of want to happen here okay so if we can get that i think that'll be a nice uh high probable type of play next one okay so video is sponsored by me make sure you guys come to awful trash club we have the original signals where you get my buys and sells for options and shares. We also have a chat room where we'll be talking the markets every day. Make sure you come snag that up. Once this gets to 200, it will be full and it will be closed. Okay, I keep telling you because I know people would be messaging me. Can I get in? No, you can't. 
you have to wait till somebody leaves. That's the only way to get in. But until this pool is not there yet, so make sure you come get your spot in a regular. And then we have VIP. You get everything in a regular, and VIP also gets their own uh, disco room and different signals. Okay, very, very more precise, clean signals. I think VIP is the best bang for your buck. And you get two monthly live teaching zooms. You also get 27, 24 7 access to the stock market options crash course. So the crash course does come in the VIP. Okay, VIP is, is more of me teaching you how to trade than just coming for signals, okay? It's more of me teaching you how to trade. And once this gets to 50, it will be closed. It is getting close to there. So I'll advise you guys to come on and get your spot because once it's closed, it's closed. And you can still use Will Half Off until February 7th to get 50% off. Will Half Off discount code to get 50% off. Stock Market Options Crash Course to better help you learning. Make sure you guys don't forget to get your Moomoo account. That's where I'm depositing $100 to start the $100 challenge. We'll be picking the plays together on the live stream. I will be live streaming 9.30 a.m. Central Time every day. So make sure you come there. But we'll start with $100 on the Moomoo account. You do get up to five free stocks. So when you get your Moomoo account, you deposit $100. The five free stocks might even equal the $100. So you basically plan it for free. Okay. So there's really no downfall to it. I am sponsored by Moomoo. I was I wanted to pick a different pap, platform to do the challenge on, so I did pick Moomoo. I am sponsored by them, so make sure you come get your account. I think I'll be starting around Monday, okay? Probably well, not Monday. I, I'll let you guys know when we start uh, the the challenge, okay? But it will be soon. I just want to give you guys some time to kind of get the money settled and stuff. And then make sure you come subscribe to Will Knowledge Crypto. I want to get to a thousand subscribers, okay? Make sure you subscribe over here. Make sure you come check out the videos. I did post a video on Cardano, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and uh, Dogecoin. Make sure you come check it out and subscribe. And let's go back to the charts. It is go, go, ticker symbol, G-O-G-O, -O, ticker symbol, G-O-G-O. -O. Now, with this one, kind of traded sideways a little bit. Pressure came in a little bit, pulled back. That's good. And now we're seeing that steep pressure, okay? Very steep. So we want is, we do want some pullback. We don't want to buy uh while price is just shooting up like this so i do have a buying level of about 13 i would say about 1325 is where i'll be looking for some pullback because it has been running so i don't want to really want to chase price we don't have to chase price honestly and then i'll probably be looking to exit this one at about 15 dollars because i was even thinking about buying now but i'd rather wait for some pullback so that'll be about a 13% gain. But say we bought now while price is running, that would be only about a 7% gain. So we will need that type of pullback. And if it's a consistent run, that pullback will come. Just like how this run came, we had the pullback and then it went higher, right? So what we're looking for is we're looking for a run, pullback, run, pullback, run, pullback. That's what I'm kind of looking for here. So we do need that pullback to kind of get in this play. But these are the main two levels I'm kind of looking out for, for ticker symbol G-O-G-O. -G -O. And the last one is Casava Sciences, ticker symbol S-A-V-A -A for Sava, ticker symbol S-A-V-A. -A. Now, with this one, let's go ahead and clear the levels. You guys know um, I did play this one. I forgot what day it was. Oh, this day. I think that was the 10th. I played it on the 10th. We caught that nice run up, bought down here, exited at $60, close to the high. That was a nice play on Sava. Haven't played it since. So it's been like, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So about 10 days since I've played it. And I'm finally starting to see a play forming. But the only thing is we will need um, a little more pressure. Because I actually want some buying pressure like around 42, 42, 45 in that area. I want buying pressure to occur. But this will be, uh, especially this one. This will be a buying level really for Monday. I'm not looking to buy this one today because I think we might come to some resistance, probably around like $45. I'll put, I'll put it at $45. Make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at will.knowledge. Will.knowledge. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. So resistance level around 45. So we have to watch that as well. That's why I don't I don't want to buy it yet. I kind of want to wait till Monday. Because the buying level to resistance is about 6%. And I want to take it up to about 50, which would be about an 18% gain. So that's what I'm kind of watching out right now. I do like Sava. The short interest is getting a little high. They probably pushed them out here a little bit. But then they did reload those shorts up, which is why the short interest is going up. So I do think we can get some nice moves in here. And I'll probably go heavy on this one also. 
so make sure you watch out for these two levels but those are main levels i'm looking at hope you guys enjoyed this video always remember not a recommendation to buy or sell anything this is for educational purposes only so do not trade anything you see or hear in a video and i'll catch you guys in the next one